Hi, Natalia. Are you enjoying the party? Oh, hi, Liam. Yes, it's great, thanks. You weren't in the office last week, were you? No. I went back to Dublin to visit my parents for a few days. Really? I've always wanted to go to Ireland. What's Dublin like? Well, it's the capital city, of course. But it's changed a lot since I was a child. Now it's very cosmopolitan, and parts of it are very modern. Right. The city centre is very touristy too, but Dublin is still a great place to visit. I don't know much about Ireland, actually. What are the people like? Well, they're very welcoming, and they really like tourists. I think you'd find them very helpful and relaxed. Does everyone speak English? Yes. But sometimes the accent is a bit hard to understand, even for me. A lot of people speak Irish Gaelic too. Okay. And Dubliners are very sociable. They love getting together in the evenings and having a drink and listening to people playing Irish folk music. And of course, Dublin has some of the best pubs in the world. Do you know Guinness, our famous black beer? Yes, I've had Guinness here in England. Ah. But English Guinness is not like Irish Guinness. <laughs> and of course, Irish whiskey is very famous too. And what's the food like? Well, you get the same food as you do in the UK most of the time. But we also have some very tasty Irish dishes. Do you know Irish stew? No. What's that? It's made of lamb, potatoes, carrots and onions, all cooked together. You often get it in the pubs at lunch times. It's really delicious. And it's quite healthy too. Sounds good. <laughs> and what's the weather like? Well, it's often wet and windy. Ireland is famous for its rain. And in winter, it's freezing, of course. But on a sunny day, there's no better place in the world. So when is the best time to visit? Well, the weather in July and August is usually quite good. But probably the best time to visit is around St. Patrick's Day, which is on March 17th. Okay. But what happens then? In Dublin, there's St. Patrick's Festival, which is brilliant. Everyone in the city wears green, and it's basically one long party for three days and nights. That sounds fun. <laughs> I really must go. You'll have a fantastic time, <laughs> I promise. Hey, would you like to see some photos of Dublin? Yes, that would be great. I've got some on my mobile phone, I think. Track 53. What's the city like? What are the people like? What's the food like? What's the weather like? Track 54. 1. W. Go on. To Italy. You ever. Two. Y. The end. My aunt. Stay in. Three. R. For ages. For about. Over eighty. Track 55. What happens at the end of the film? They all go on a trip to Italy. Have you ever been to England? Yes, my aunt's lived there for ages. Who's the oldest person in your family? 
My uncle, he's over eighty. How long has she been at the agency? For about seven or eight years. Do you always go out on Sundays? No, we often stay in and watch TV. Face to Face, Second Edition, Pre-Intermediate, by Chris Redston and Jilly Cunningham. This recording is copyright. Cambridge University Press, 2012. CD three. Track one. One. Morning, Hannah. Do you want some coffee? No, thanks, Kira. I haven't got time. I overslept again. Oh dear. A late night, was it? Yes, a bit. Look, I have to go. If I'm late again, I'll lose my job. <sighs> Don't worry. You'll be okay if you get a taxi. Yes, good idea. Have you got the number of a taxi company? Yes, I have. I'll call them now. Right. Have a good day. You too. See you later. Two. Where are the car keys? I can't find them anywhere. I don't know, Jim. Where did you put them last? That's a silly question, isn't it? What time does the film start? In about twenty-five minutes. Well, if we don't leave soon, we won't get there in time. Yes, I know. Maybe you can help me look for them. Are they in your coat pocket? No, they're not. I've looked. Okay, I'm just trying to help. I'm sorry. Look, if we don't find them, I'll take you out for dinner instead.、Mm, that sounds good. Three. Oh, this is terrible. Yes, I know. If we don't get there by five, we'll miss the plane. Well, why didn't we leave sooner? Don't worry, we'll get there. We just have to be patient. Oh. <sighs> Why have you turned off the sat nav? It can't help us when we're stuck in traffic, can it? What will we do if we're too late? Well, we'll have to get the next flight. Just relax, all right? Okay, sorry. Oh, I hate going on holiday. Next year, let's just stay at home. Fine by me. Track two. I lose my job. If I'm late again, I lose my job. We won't get there in time. If we don't leave soon, we won't get there in time. If you get a taxi, you'll be okay. If you get a taxi, we'll miss the plane. If we don't get there by five, we'll miss the plane. If we're too late, what will we do if we're too late? I'll take you out 